Well, these days you can buy anything on the internet, but a new study says some breast milk bought online may be contaminated. As WFMC's Jackie Ferris tells us, there are ways to help ensure the milk you feed your baby is safe. Try not to spill it. Kara Petrosky of Emmaus has three small children. All three of them have had donor milk, and it's been wonderful. Her youngest is Paige. Because of health problems, the Petrosky kids have had to rely on the breast milk of more than 100 mothers. Kira Lichtenwalner is one of them. My milk is helping more children grow out there. I've donated 11 gallons of milk. Using donor milk is a common practice in the United States, but a new study says you should be careful where you get it. The study in November's issue of Pediatrics found bacteria in some milk purchased on the internet. Petrosky gets her milk from a free milk sharing program called Eats and Feats, an organization that developed four pillars of safe breast milk sharing that includes extensive education, donor screening, pasteurization, and safe handling of milk and equipment. Using proper guidelines for um, Cleaning your, you know, the breast pump equipment for washing your hands before nursing, before storing the milk. At Mother Baby Naturals in Bethlehem, Christy Hume helps mothers deal with breastfeeding issues and has this advice for moms who need donor milk. If you're going to buy milk, you need to buy it from a company that um, goes through a very detailed history of the mother's history. I had a DNA testing done, I had blood work done. In addition to milk sharing, Kira Lichtenwaller also donates to milk banks. She says there are a lot of breast milk resources in the Lehigh Valley and she's happy to help other mothers like Petrosky. We stay in touch on Facebook, so I get to see pictures all the time. <laughs> Jackie Ferris, 69 News.